In this video, we will learn how to create this creative dispersion shoe effect using Photoshop Actions. It will be fun, so let's jump in Photoshop. Welcome back everyone. My name is Adnan Jodhri from Test Tutorials. Today we are going to create this amazing uh, dispersion effect but it is pretty much uh, simple and you don't need to mess with photoshop uh, with couple of times to do this creating, creating dispersion effect so this uh, action will uh, make your life too much easy so before we start let me just uh, show you what we how we can do this first of all we'll create a selection around the shoe and after that when we'll apply our effect it will be look like this uh, let's just have an another example this one like first this was the shoe after that creating selection around this shoe and right after that when we apply our effect it will be look like this amazing uh, dispersion shoe so let's just take another example and today we will use this one so this is the background layer when we will create selection around our shoe after applying our effect it will be look like this amazing shoe so it's just a simple work no need to mess with photoshop so without wasting any time let's just start before we start let me just delete these layers so we could create another uh, uh, work so before start when you will download your files you will see that it will be a creative dispersion photoshop if uh, actions zip file you will extract that and there will be a folder and two file first file is uh, atn means action file and second one is a uh, brush file so go to photoshop go to edit uh, preset preset manager go to load from the load you will see that navigate your uh, folder to the folder which where you have downloaded this uh, file or extracted that file you will see that there is effects folder uh, file uh, click select and click on load so it will be loaded into the photoshop hit done now go to windows actions from the action menu go to this icon and go to load actions and load actions you will see that there is a creative dispersion uh, action so click on load you will see that there are a couple of things in this action so we will talk about them later so first of all close this panel and go to uh, basically we need to create a selection so you can use different type of uh, ways to create selection your basic purpose is to create this uh, selection so we'll go to quick selection tool and we'll create a selection around this shoe uh, it will create very nicely and gently so press alt to prevent shadows from selection that's nice and the front is not so important so we we'll just leave it as uh, as it is like this okay so our basic purpose is to create selection around this shoe so we'll create a new layer name this layer as brush keep in mind that we will name this uh, we will uh, name this layer in lowercase uh, the name is brush and uh, we'll fill it with any color any sharp color you you, you could uh, use so we'll use a red color or you can use any of them it's not important for uh, this action so next thing is that click and open these actions and click on let's create it and open this to see what's going on here but before start actions go to edit purge and all it will erase all the history of your photoshop so it could the action file will work more fastly hit ok then click on play and wait for the process to complete its work it will not it will not uh, take too much time it will just it will take a short time to complete this so uh, it will stop here okay so now it's asking that with, where, uh, put it where you like and let freeze area for the dispersion so it means that it is saying that put the shoe where you want to put in this area so we don't want to move this so click on continue and we will directly click on check mark you can just place it anywhere else anywhere you want to so click on check mark and it will 
move to the further steps so now it is asking that make it bigger where you want dispersion so it is saying that uh, make it size to bigger so we'll click on continue and size it up like this so what basically it will do when you will create dispersion the shoe color will be inside this dispersion so we'll make it bigger size so the dispersion effect will work more looks more cool like same as shoe so click on check mark and now the process is asking that choose the texture you like so continue and you will see that there is a texture folder inside your file which you have downloaded and extracted so choose any of the uh, we can say that uh, uh, texture uh, first of all check which one will be much better for this so I think this one is more cool or this one or this one I think uh, this one is looks more nice yes so place uh, after placing this adjust this where it looks more nice so we will size it down a little bit you can just size it down also so like here and like uh, maybe it looks more interesting here so as we see that it looks nice here so place uh, we want this person in this side so it will disperse this area so click on check mark and the process will begin and we will wait for the process to complete its work okay so the final process is complete we will first uh, close this panel and you will see that the background is not so much cool so it's not a big, big problem you, you just take a look here you will see that there is a background named group so just turn off this group you will see that the original background is back now what you can do changes in that you can just change color adjustments you can see that this is the original color uh, this is the original color and after making some tricking on uh, with colors you will see that it looks like more nice and more amazing I really like this action file and after that uh, this is not worth it you just change more things like you can make it add shadows to this uh, shoe like uh, let's just add shadows click on play button and now it will drag a file where you want to add like I want to add it here like this one after that click on check mark and it will look like shadow so uh, what else you can do make it one image so it will basically flat this all area and you can create a basically a 3d effect also uh, if you want to create 3d I, I i really don't like 3d effect but if you want to create this 3d effect you just need to play the action now it will ask that move left or right so click continue you will see that it looks more uh maybe it looks more nice here so so click on check mark and the final effect is completed so you can reduce size and sharpen it all depends on you there's no need to do that but you, if you want to you can do that there is no problem with that so i hope you like this video and like these uh, effects all these files are given in the description bar you can free download them and uh, if you like my video please thumbs up and give it a thumbs up and uh, please subscribe to our channel the subscription is very slow so <laughs> if you are watching this you have to subscribe because it's really hard for me to find out these type of things free of course because these all are premium and uh, difficult to find out and what else only thing is left is that you just need to click on subscribe so click this red beautiful sexy subscribe button and turn it into white you just you don't need to you not only uh, subscribe click on this bell icon so every time we will publish a new video or new action file you will get a notification that we have a new video uploaded so uh, I should stop talking so much so tomorrow is my paper and uh, it's difficult to do th these things at same time so we will meet in our next video never stop and keep learning